Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ari Dominique and I'm back with another video. If you're new, hey, and if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a comment down below. Without further ado, let's get straight into this video. So as you guys can tell by the title, today I'm going to be showing you guys my affordable bags that I've acquired. Um, some of these places are going to be from Ross, Amazon, and Fashion Nova. I just want to leave that disclaimer that if you do see a bag that you like from Ross, I would advise you just to go see it in the store and check it out if you guys can find it as well. And um, anything that you see in this video will also be either linked down below and have the prices or will tell you which store, well not or, but and will tell you which store I got it from and how much it was. My first bag is, why am I presenting like my first bag? But the first bag that I want to show y'all is this beautiful bag. I don't know why I love this bag so much. I know that it's a lot going on between the patent leather, the pearls, the leather, and the freaking chain. I don't know if this is supposed to be a grunge look or a pretty look, but it's an acquired taste. <laughs> no, but like that's serious. I, I love this bag so much. I got this from Ross also to put that out there. Um, it was $8.99. As I said, I will leave these prices down below so that you guys don't forget. So, the way you open this bag is you twist it and you pull it up. The space inside is extremely minimal, but you know that this is um, on trend right now. So little tiny bags, I guess no one really cares about what you need to actually put in them. But I will say that I've gotten lip gloss, my card, my license, and my, um, my uh, what's it called? uh my keys in here i don't even know if i said that already but my keys all that fit in here and that's really all you need oh and some cash that's your essentials when you're going out so i would never wear this bag like on the chain i'm gonna put it on and show y'all i just don't feel like that's what i'm going for but i guess if you need it like say you're going out on a night in a town and it's like this bag just goes with your outfit but you really don't feel like carrying your bag I guess you can use the chain, but I think I actually, let me see, that's what I remember. Yeah, I think I either clipped the things off or just tucked it inside. So you can go either way with it, if I can get it closed. Okay, you can go either way with this and I wanna get up close with this. And then the pearls just set it off <laughs> for me. So like I said, you can find this bag at Ross um, for, I found it for $8.99, that's literally so cheap. And I was like, if I don't leave here with this store, the whole story bitch. <laughs> if I don't leave there with this bag, I'm gonna be upset. And I'm also gonna insert an Instagram picture of what I look like wearing this bag. I wore it with this dress, so I don't even know if I really need to insert a picture with this bag because I'm wearing the outfit. <laughs> and y'all can see how it goes. So clearly I will wear this bag with something like this. So on to my next bag. So my next bag is this cute little vintage number giving very much vintage. Let me see if I can pull up with you guys. It w I would never probably wear it with this dress. So I don't even know if that was as cute as me showing y'all, just showing y'all what the bag was. But I also found this at freaking Ross for $19.99. So you know it probably rounded to like $22 or something like that. But it's a freaking Aldo bag. It's so cute. Like it just, it gives me like 2000 vibes when they, when, I wasn't old enough to be going out at that time, but when they would go out, they had a little purse and like that little halter top. This is what this bag reminds me of. And I love it so much because it has that croc detailing and it has the, you can go either way with this bag. So it has the Aldo logo. I still haven't even taken this bag off, this off. And I think I wore this bag like three times already. I didn't even know this sticker was on there. So excuse that, but it has the Aldo logo here and, um, Hardware, this is like the, oh, well, I guess we'll just take it off. <laughs> it has the Aldo sticker here, I mean logo here in the metal hardware. And then it also has it printed into the bag. And like, can y'all just see that detail? I don't even know what, like if this is like real leather or like whatever, but I just think that's so cute. And so inside the bag, I was talking about, I think the croc, crocodile snake skin i don't know which one it is we're gonna go croc them i just love that um that detail so inside actually before we talk about inside the bag the bag also comes with this strap it's off because i would just 
I don't like my bags being too long as you can see from the last bag I was like I would never wear it like that but I did keep it just in case one day I needed it and of course you can shorten it with these things right here so on to the inside of the bag it is one of the actually I did not think that this bag was gonna hold everything everything I carry in one of the bags I'm gonna show you which is much bigger than this fit into this bag so I thought that was really cool but it has a zipper pouch right here for I guess the thing that you wouldn't want automatically showing when you open your bag at first and then it has the um you know every bag has like a little side pouch so it has that and then of course all this space which held my freaking keys my keys with the lanyard um lip gloss two masks uh and I'm talking about the fancy lip gloss so it, it holds a lot and um I didn't even name a lot of stuff, but it holds a lot of stuff. So if you guys are looking for something like this, I recommend you heading to freaking Aldo and just seeing if you can find something. If you can't find this exact bag, it'll probably be something similar there. So I hope you guys enjoyed that one. This right here is my next bag that I want to show you guys. Okay, so this bag is from Amazon and I love it so much. It also, it of course came with this. This is a, um, I just be holding the chains up, but it's a, uh, can see what it is i can't think of what it's called though it's like a crossbody strap whatever so it has the envelope detail the thing i like this about this bag is that it's very sturdy it's not one of those flimsy bags it's not going to give out on you in a couple years but we're going to go on the inside it reminds me the inside reminds me of like when you were a little girl and you had those church bags this is what that reminds me of so not much is in here you would just have your essentials once again and your um oh money <laughs> you have your um well yeah speaking of money that's where i would probably put my money in my cards i think i did that when i carried this bag and then when you close it it just snaps closed just like that so then this handle that's what i like too it's like it's like i said it's very sturdy like i never would think i would go out and something would happen to this bag so if you guys need something or like are more into sturdier type of bags this is definitely the one for you and these oh i should mention that too this um chain does come off so you won't have to have a tuck moment it'll unclip and reclip if you need it if you guys are interested in the mat in this bag the link is down below in my description this bag is from fashion nova and i love it so much because it has that it's like a mix between the last two bags it has that crocodile print with the gold hardware and detail and then it also is small so that it kind of is like a staple with your outfit so it's like a mix and i think i really just needed this bag so we'll get into what it looks like so of course fashion Nova wouldn't fail and has the handle matching the bag which when i bought the bag i did not know it did that and so when i got it i instantly fell in love because i didn't know that it just carried the details of throughout the entire bag i would also say that it's one of those bags that will not give out on you in a couple days. You'll have it for a good while if you take care of your things. So, you open the bag like the other one. Oh, I'm close on me. <laughs> you open the bag like the other one by with this magnetic clip. And you, when you open it, it came like this. Of course, the chain on the inside. But I don't have to repeat myself. It's all for a reason. <laughs> so, we're just going to put that down. So when you open this, one thing I didn't, I don't, yeah, one thing I didn't like this bag, I didn't even notice it did that until just now. But one thing I don't like about this bag just now is that it's restricted on opening because of the detailing in this. So it's like it's not going to open because it's clipped on with these circles. But if that doesn't really matter to you, this is how much space you're getting. I could put my whole hand in there. Um... I just was about to say my phone can fit in there, but I'm recording on my phone, so we're not gonna try that right now. But my phone did fit in here. I didn't have to carry it around like the other bag. Um, and it also has a zippered moment, which I can't get to because the way the bag is closed. So without further ado, instead of going on this bag so much, if you're just into the styling and just carrying it maybe for a photo or it goes with your outfit that day and you don't really need to carry that many things, this is a perfect bag for you. It's a very affordable bag and I caught it on a sale and you know Fashion Nova always has a sale. So you're never gonna pay overpriced for this bag. So let's just show you guys some more detailing of it. The back is the same. And then the bottom, it holds up 
through the sides. So that's one thing I also like too, because I don't like that wear and tear that can come sometimes come on bags when it doesn't have the feet installed into it. And if you know what I mean by the feet, it's like just little dots that they're little metal hardwares that go on the bottom of the bag. So there are two things that I love about this bag. One being that it's from Aldo and two that I did not pay Aldo price for it. I actually got this bag from TJ Maxx and it was probably, it was $20 because after tax it went up to $20. So I got this bag in the summer of, actually I don't know which summer. It was, it was very recent. Of course it was within the year and um, it has lasted me so much. Like this is my everyday bag and that's what I'm saying. Like it's lasting me because I wear, like this is something I'll grab and I'll just take it with me, throw it in the car or if I need to go grocery shopping. I just have this on my back because I just don't want to carry a purse around or something. So that's what I love about this bag. Um, it doesn't have the feet on it, but to my well, not to my surprise because it's Aldo bag, so it's good material. <laughs> not that other things aren't good material. I mean, so we'll just go straight into it. So the front part, literally, two hands can fit in that plus my wrist. So <laughs> that shows you how much space you get with the front. And then the side, oh, I love this bag so much. The sides, the side, the back compartment is extremely deep. So if you need to, whatever you need to throw in here, like even if you're vlogging that day, like this vlog stick I have right now, you could throw that in here. That's how big this is. So inside this bag, it has the deepness, of course, that I love. And anything you needed to fit in there that day, like it would fit. You wouldn't be, um... Because I would consider this a mini bag, you wouldn't be compromised and have to leave something home. So that's what I like about this. It's so much space. I've never had to like not bring something because it didn't fit. Um, unlike the other bags that I showed you guys. So it has the first bag, the first compartment where you, I guess you just would slip something quick in there. And then of course the zippered part where if you don't want your eyes on that. And then you turn it around, you can have like a lip gloss compartment. You guys can't even see that. A lip gloss compartment or the um or like your phone can go right there if you need it real quick real quick that's what i would use that for too so i'm gonna zip that up and if you guys are interested in anything that's like brand name but you don't want to like of course spend that much money on it check those retail stores that sell you know um second i don't even know what's it's not like second hand but like when the retail store that you like so aldo would send those things to those stores check those stores like don't sleep on them like ross tj maxx and um i think it's marshall's is the last one those are the places to go if you're looking for something that's super cute and super stylish just like i showed you guys but without further ado i'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here if you haven't already hit that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment on how you felt what was your favorite bag let me know and also, follow me on Instagram at aria.dominique, and if you are interested in these lashes, they are from my brand at Royal Lux Lash Bar on Instagram, and I'll also leave the link to my website down below. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one.